Hello, welcome back to Let's Play Tower of Time. I'm your host, Bring It Dawn. Uh, I'm actually back at the place where I was just to input this code. And uh, we're going to try, we're going to guess the second letter, because I don't feel like waiting anymore. So actually, let me... Uh... So what is it? It's 2 blank 0 8. All right. So 2 1 0 8. Two two zero eight two three zero eight two four zero eight. There we go. Teleporter activated. Easy peasy, guys. Easy peasy. Wow, that is terrible. That is that is atrocious. Ten damage, really. I was that was hot garbage. All right, let's fight this guy as well. Our guys, I guess. A bunch of void shadow constructs. No biggie. It's a defense tower. Oh wait, no, it's portals. All right, hold on. Twenty-two seconds, and wait, is it just the one portal? All right, that's easy enough. Drop him over there, and everybody go get this thing. Are we immobilized? Because that's annoying if so. That's right, th that guy's aura immobilizes us. Alright, let's mess these guys up. Yeah. Get rid of this guy real quick, because he's messing up my uh my archer. I currently don't have a way to heal. Oh wait. There we go. Why does y'all need to move? Get back. Oh, son of a gun. That aura is very annoying. It immobilizes you as soon as you walk into it. That's rough. That's fine. Just keep killing these guys. Right, there's another defense tower down here. Go take care of that real quick. So when he rages, he also loses movement speed. That's interesting. I wonder if Boron loses movement speed when he rages as well. Because he has that ability. I don't like it because you lose control of him. But he does a lot more damage and all that jazz. I actually wonder if he can attack his own teammates when he loses control. Probably not. I don't think there's any friendly fire in the game. I thought there was in the beginning. Um, I kept thinking that uh, Irix Blizzard did friendly fire to be like Ent and stuff, but don't think that it does. It's nice, you know, because the game with all this AOE stuff, it would be a real pain in the butt if it had friendly fire. That guy was tanky as crap. He did not want to go down. Yeah. Yeah, I think when you finish all the other objectives, the rest of the enemies should rush you. Because this is too easy. Fighting two of them at a time, three of them at a time. That's just not it's not challenging. Granted, I am playing on a relatively easy difficulty, so that's probably my own fault. He took a lot of damage.
All right, easy peasy. Garbage and might be good. Seems like garbage though. Let's just check real quick. Uh, I'm gonna go let and say garbage. There we go. Thought that was gold up there. What oh, fountain? Um, sure. Speed increased by five. That's a hefty. It's a hefty buff. Well, hot dog. What are you at now, Kate? In your character development. Eh, 12. That's not that great. He's, he's a pretty tanky boy, though. There's, there's no doubt about that. Alright, let's go dispel this last magic barrier and finish wiping the tower avatar's memory. the right one? Yeah. A little confused, all these teleporters and stuff. Alright, and here we are. Magic Barrier. Uh, who speaks first? Smart man knows the name of every poisonous flowering plant in the north. A wise man knows which poisonous plants can be taken in the proper dose to cure sickness. I have no idea. I mean, she's basically neutered at this point anyway. Yeah, but she can't remember that. So like she's her memory is basically gone. I'm sure this will give us more insight as to what happened. Only your third attempt, though. Yeah. I wonder if she does get through, and that's how she ends up siding with Proteus, but then she turns against him. Like, she's against him, but the way she was speaking previously, she was on his side. Oh. How do they know that he's corrupted by the Organte? See, that's that's new information there. What is wrong? The Magi endowed me with true self-determination, yet despite this miracle, ordered me back to Proteus's barrier. Clearly something was amiss. To my deepest regret, the truth did not evade me for long. My creator's inner thoughts revealed a web of shadows and lies, and one horrible truth. The Magi no longer sought Proteus to recruit his aid, but instead to kill him, to remove the final obstruction preventing the Organti arrival. Shortly after I came into this world, I was forced to choose between my parents the duty they set upon me, and my own morality. I chose to stay faithful, not to my creators, but to the people of Artara. For many days and nights, the tower erupted in war. The Magi fought with ravenous desperation, and though formidable, underestimated the powers at my disposal. I retasked the ancient crystal golems into warriors, 
and created new constructs of my own design. When the Magi banded together in the depths of the tower for one final stand, I descended upon them with the full might of the tower and destroyed them all. I took no pleasure in destroying my misguided creators, but my vow and duty is to the tower and Artara. I have sworn to stand vigil over both for time eternal. After all the Magi's lies, Proteus's goal supports my own. Protect the tower and the people of Artara. Unwilling to lower his barrier, the first Magus has remained confined. He leaves me to protect the tower as I see fit, and I in turn leave him to his own. But I must learn more of this Proteus for I have already glimpsed a sliver of dark or ganty influence in his mind. I sense it is only a matter of time before he too is corrupted by their lies. Only a matter of time until I must destroy the first Magus. Okay, that answers a lot of questions. My companions have nothing to say. There we go. Hmm. It's odd that each one <coughs> of the recorders has gotten slightly more kind of damaged as we moved on. The first one was pristine, the second one was a little banged up. This one's basically done. Lockwork storage facility. Oh. <coughs> I wonder if it was her or if it was Proteus. Well, Proteus hasn't left his barrier, so. Out of the tower is nearly in sight. Okay, I've already read all this in that journal right there. Yeah, we've already read that. It, she's a person, essentially. Like, um, you're, you're wiping out a living creature's memories. At this point, what does it matter? She again, she's lost two thirds of her memory. Centuries of accrued experience, but limited to inside the tower itself. Good job, my youth. Way, way to figure it out. <laughs> Poor Boron, trying to be the good guy. Uh oh. Okay. 
That doesn't necessarily mean anything. There could be a good reason why she's trying to stop us. Well, I have to. I mean, I have to beat the game, so... There's achievements that, that await me at the bottom of the tower. She has a blade? I think she has like these blades on her back. <laughs> oh, about to fight Clockwork Men? Is it Age of, Age of Wonders? Or Age of something? Alright, so we gotta fight her one more time. Take no pleasure in this tower avatar, but... I must put a stop to you. Alright, let's do this. Uh, that. Let's throw that there as well. Portal first. Uh, that portal is about to. Oh boy. I might hold off whatever comes out of the other portal. I need to focus her down, I think. Oh yeah, those guys are a joke. Just focus on her. On her then. Uh, bam. And then burn. And then this. That's a lot of guys. Alright, Kane. Do what you do best, big guy. I don't know if he can handle that all by himself, but... I'll send him some support. Uh, I'll send her to help. There we go. She can drop them all without much... What the heck did, why did he run forward? Get back over here. What are you doing? Goodness gracious. Alright, get over there and help. Oh my goodness, there's so many of them. Alright. Uh huh. Might be in a bit of a bind. Go help out. Um. That was a bad idea, I guess. Uh, hang in there, Kane. Could have gone much better. I should do this by herself. This will be fun. Right, whatever. This is a slower attack speed. Hello. Oh yeah, we got we got this under control. I mean, I could have done this fight a lot smarter. I'll be fine though, I think. Hey, I'll finish her off, please.
Come on. Finish her off. Oh, okay, I just had to beat her. Didn't have to finish the other portal off. Hot dog. Alright, 15 armor. Lose 6% armor. But the crit chance, that might be good on... With tears. But she's a machine. Look at that armor, though. Look at that. The red flowing through it. Reminds me of the, uh... The Dragon Age armor. Uh, you get for like pre-ordering Dragon Age Origins. It's pretty cool looking, not gonna lie. But why? What is what is Proteus's plan? I'm assuming he's corrupted by the Argante. She said that she noticed it slightly, even you know, a thousand years ago. Secret passage must listen. But with the databanks destroyed, she can't retain any memory now, can she? Of course she doesn't. She's like a child. Nope, yep. <coughs> Called it. way down that was way back I don't actually remember where that was at um, shoot Does this take us down tower log okay I gotta find the way down then did I not activate that travel disk So maybe, yeah, this is the past that she's talking about. You're always intrigued, Whisper. God, I hate you. The bottom of the tower awaits.
Okay, so we've solidified that the the Magi were corrupt, probably from listening to the uh, recordings or whatever, and that Proteus was in the right at first. So that was it. But we already... How is that any worse than what happened in the room? I don't understand. because he's probably been corrupted since then. Ah, you'll be, be okay, Kane. Undo with the consequences of my actions. Dude, you're like a level away from the bottom. God. Yeah, I need you to tank for me, man. You can't go anywhere. Boron can't do it, and Rakeem sure as heck can't do it. Oh, I didn't know she could become flesh and blood. Alright, so we finished. Alright, and then we've already read that. There's an ancient chest over here with some pants or some britches. Grab that and Avatar's Creation Band. I was hoping to be a little better. That's pretty solid. Um, might be good on Kane. As would some of these other britches. Five might. What is this health regen at now? Pretty solid. Just have to put some thorns on here and he'll be good to go. Now 37% earth resistance. It's already maxed out, so I don't need more. Um, this might be better for him. Increases most resistances. Lose some health regen. Loses mana points, but gains movement speed. Yeah, yeah, not worth it. So let's look at this, uh, this. Uh, 
Now, these are both pretty good. I mean, three armor, though. I mean, it's a little something-something. Some more void resistance. Bunch of health, so... Are these the same thing? No. Health regeneration, seven. Uh, he needs to keep that, so he doesn't... Point one, not very high health regen, but and then five life though, it's pretty solid. I'll just get rid of it. No, I won't. That'd be good on like Boron or somebody. There you go, big guy. All right, well. I have no idea where I'm supposed to go to go down. I think I need to go to this travel disc and go across to there, because I missed that. Guess we're just gonna leave her there. Seems fair, I guess. This way's a shorter run to the teleporter. Uh, go here and then I can get to the teleporter and teleport further into the level. I don't know if I activated this teleporter that was over here. Let's check it out real quick, and then we'll probably call it an episode from there. Then I'll next episode I'll figure out how the heck I'm supposed to get to wherever that big generator was. Oh, it was here. Right? Okay, yeah, it was right here. Okay, yeah, this is the way I needed to go. Well, lesson learned. A bunch of travel discs. Well, that's fascinating. Wait, what? Did it split my party up? Hey. Well, that's interesting. Alright. Don't think I like any of this. 20 health. Oh. teleporter right beside me. I just want to run around. I want to get prepared to descend to the next level. So in the next episode we can just skip right to it, you know? No need to dilly-daddle. Contaminated zone. Garbage and garbage. Actually, that might not be too bad. Might be good on her. I have some enchanting to do off camera in preparation for the final battle. Here's a him, so. An iron ore sealed off by fallen stone. Zero and one. Okay. Very damaged console. Let's go back to that other teleporter because I think this is the way we have to go. Purple usually indicates Organte, I think. If my theory is correct, then, uh... Organte await us. Or one corrupted by Organte. Try to get rid of these real quick. Bellis Magi have become the mirror image of their noble brothers. This transporter honors the memory of those fallen heroes. Let the sacrifice of their number never be forgotten, even when seen through the eyes of distorted rebels. Quick Power Edge of Event Horizon. Which is funny because that's the name of the people who created the game. 
Seven mastery, that's pretty solid. Chamber of Peace. List of mag magi who gave themselves over in the Great Sacrifice. He doesn't need might, so he'd benefit from the uh, health regen, I think. Well, that seems to be everything in this level. Let's uh, go back and get ready to descend. There's a fight up ahead. I don't want to commit to that in this episode. Okay, so she can access a single file, but she's locked out of most of it. So they're trying to make another hole for the Argante to come into. Alright, you know what? We are going to do this fight. And then prepare to descend in the uh, final episode. Void Horror. Alright, let's do it. I like the name of these uh, shadow constructs. Like Lightbreaker and... Uh, I don't remember what the name of the other one was. There was another name though, darn it, that I liked. This, that, that. They have like 400,000 health? No, 200,000. You're not going anywhere, man. I got you taunted, son. Alright, let's do that. 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 Hey, leave her alone. Gosh darn it. Job there, uh, big guy. All right, good deal with that guy. attack so quietly except for what's your face uh naive all right dude get out of here
Oh man, he went down. No! I thought he'd live forever. Alright, we still got this. I'm not too worried about it. Irex the only one left to attack. It's not dazed. as well. Oh, that's right. We already read that one. All right. And here we are preparing to descend to the, uh, the final level. Uh, thanks for watching. And I hope to catch you on the next level or in the next, uh, next episode. And we'll, we'll wrap this up. Thanks for watching.